Example 2. Japan has a VAT of 8%. John purchased a calculator with a pre-tax price of $17. So question A says calculate the VAT payable on the calculator. And that's as simple as taking your percentage, dividing it by 100 and timesing it by the amount. Okay, so our percentage is 8. It's an 8% 8 VAT. Divide 100 and the amount is 17. And that gives us 1.36 or $1.36. All right, now question B says, what is the total cost of the calculator, including the VAT? So what we've got to do is add the price of the calculator to the tax or the VAT, and that will give us $18.36. All right, moving on to question C. John also purchases a textbook for $69, and this includes the VAT, and it wants you to calculate the pre-tax price of the textbook. So once again, this is one of those questions where you use four boxes. So here's our four boxes now. Um, so we've got the $69, let's put that here. That includes, uh, sorry, not, I was about to write GST, includes the VAT. All right, and we mentioned earlier that that's well, actually this would be a hundred and eight percent of the price because sixty nine dollars includes the original price, which was at a hundred percent plus an extra eight percent on top of that. So we need to figure out the amount that goes here, which matches with a hundred percent of the price, meaning the original price. Now I'm going to do this one a little differently this time. Last time I had arrows coming down. I just want to show you that it can work with arrows going to the left. Either way, it will work. So how do I get from 108 to 100? And I need to multiply it by something. And I don't know what I'm going to multiply it by. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take 100 and I'm going to divide it by 108. And that should give me the number I want. What do I get? Which gives me not a particularly nice decimal, but 0 0.925. I'm going to keep as many numbers as I can. 9, 2, 5. Oh, it's a repeater. So it's, let's scribble that out. 0 0.925 repeater. Okay. So if I times by 0 0.925 repeater, that line meaning it repeats. It should take me from 108 to 100. I'm, I'm just going to check check that now. Yep, it does that. So I'm going to do the same here, times 0 0.925 repeater. And the way I'm going to write it in my calculator, I'm going to go 69 to represent the $69, and I'm going to times it by 0 0.925, 925, 925. Oh, I think I can write it again. Just write it as many times as you want, as you can. And that comes out to $63.89. So the original, the, the price before the VAT was added would be $63.89.